Hello, Living Waters, and welcome to our midday, midweek prayer. Uh, this week we're using a prayer for healing. Uh, this is from the, actually from the book of Common Worship. How about that? So yes, we will use that prayer of healing um, at our petitions as well. I do appreciate the prayer requests that have been coming in. This is good. I'm trying to make sure we add them all. If I did miss one, or if you have additional prayer requests, please uh, comment. And we'll, they'll be prayed for. Okay. Let us pray. Compassionate God, your Son gives rest to those weary with heavy burden. Heal the sick in body, mind, and spirit. Lift up the depressed. Refriend those who grieve. Comfort the anxious. Stand with all the victims of abuse and violence. Help Hold those who live with addiction. This time we lift up prayers for encouragement for Ellen, Josh, Brock, Brenda, Carol, John, Todd, Dee, Elaine, Herb, and Gail. Pray for healing for Ida, Susan, Millie, Don, Pedro, Sandy, Jenny, Sarah, Yvonne, Dennis, Kristen, John, Denise, Nadia, Betty, Mercy, Rosemary, Spencer, Kim, Lexi, Jackie, Jen, Natasha, Gordon, Courtney, Joan, Ben, Kat, Kylie, Joe, Bill, Karen, Noah, Lynn, Kevin, Elaine, Barb, Hannah, Jackie, Tony, Lauren, Sean, Jane, Cody, Kurt, Brittany, Carol, Devin, Ken, Larry, Michelle, Lois, Zoe, Mark, Harold, Betty, Craig, Joe, and Ginny. Pray for peace for Scott, Annette, Frank, Lorraine, Katie, Agnes, Larry, Emma, and Betty. We pray for... Grief support for the Zeostra, Stone, Farino, Vanderhoof, Brown, Morgan, Mosfero, and Reese families. We pray for wisdom for all those who are making difficult decisions in these unprecedented times. For Katie and all, all those actively deployed overseas. We pray for safe travels for all who must. Peace and justice in our nation and world. We continue to pray for an end to COVID-19. Pray for so many parts of the world that are affected, especially right now, what's happening in India. We give thanks for current vaccination efforts, and we pray they continue uh, in powerful ways, both here in our nation and around the world. We give thanks for first responders, those in the medical field, all essential workers, and for spring, where there's so much new life. We also hold in prayers in this time. Uh, all students who are taking the you know, finals, AP tests, exams, that their spirits will be non-anxious and they can perform to their best of their abilities. Fill us all with your Holy Spirit. We may bear each other's burdens and so fulfill the law of Christ. God of mercy, hear our prayer. Amen. Well, thank you for praying with us uh, in these times that are so difficult. Your prayers mean a lot. So thank you so much for praying with us, for being with us in this journey. Uh, I hope you have a wonderful week, and we'll be right back here next Wednesday at noon for Midweek Midday Prayer.